Hey everybody, my name is Zach Manquin. I'm the founder of Infernal Tool Technologies and today I want to talk to you all about pain. Pain in the workplace. Yeah, we all feel it, especially in the construction industry. We really feel it. And I've been in the industry for 10 years and I'm just starting to feel it now because a lot of things that I did in my life uh, were not preventative. Um, I just wanted to work hard and now I'm feeling it. And I'm sure there's a lot of people out there too that are under that same, um, had that same mindset where you just wanted to work hard, you wanted to make money, and now you're starting to feel the pain. I know personally for me, I worked with a lot of people um, in their 60s, 50s, and some of them have retired, and 9 out of 10 of them are dealing with pain, from kneeling all day, to back pain, to wrist pain, from swinging a hammer, elbow pain, I mean, you name it. These people have pain, and some people even unfortunately turn to medications, and that leads them down a much different path. Um, and we have a huge epidemic with that nowadays. Um, but here at Infernal Tool Technologies, we're trying to change that. We're trying to help people and come up with different tools and inventions and products for all you guys. Where uh, we can just make slight changes to, to better people's lives. And so today I want to bring up to you guys a product that we're going to be putting out um, into the industry in the next few weeks or months, depending on the manufacturer that we uh, work with, if they can get it out there. But um, speaking mainly to Tyler's, um, grouting. Grouting is, the, is a tough thing to do. Um, it's painful, at least for me and the people that I know. Uh, grouting all day like it, it wears on your wrist you can feel it in your wrist and it's just painful and it's because it's got a handle all grout floats have a handle on them where you're just constantly using this motion and twisting the wrist and after a few jobs after a few years you really start to feel it even just when you like me personally when I do a grouting job now I feel it within the first two minutes. I just, I, it's, I must have uh, tweaked something or just, uh, just the pain has always persisted. As soon as I start, it just, it starts to hurt. So, so here we uh, invented a product that I think is really going to change the game for specifically grouting, but I think uh, with where we can take this, it will branch out to. A lot of people, maybe in the concrete industry, because um, they have a lot of floats, and they could it could help them. But basically, what it's going to do is it's going to transfer um, the point load of your wrist all the way down your arm, and it's going to make it, I believe, over the long term, a lot less painful. You're not going to go into grouting and just feel like you're um, dreading it or feel the pain and go home and feel the pain anymore and that's just a big goal for us here at Infernal Tool Technologies is to is to make something that not only makes your lives easier um, because this tool as well I believe will make it more efficient um, you're not going to be in as much pain so that's going to help and you're going to just work harder but not only that I believe it um, from my own experience it, it actually makes it a uh, a quicker process it's just more comfortable and with that comfort comes a uh, more speed but um yeah that's um that's something that we're trying to do here is come up with with uh, ideas that are gonna take some pain away from you because pain is is a big topic it's it's um it affects all of us and it doesn't have to be just the construction industry we all feel it at work if you have a job where you stand in the same place all day or if you're um, at a nurse and you're just running around all the time, some uh, jobs like that. I mean, the, it's, there's all different industries and we all have pain. And there's, I, I believe, massive room for innovation. And we could, we could really start um, tweaking some existing tools and technology that we have to be a little bit more comfortable and, and um, preventative uh, for all of us. And... I think that there's obviously a lot of new technology and innovation that could come out that, that could change our lives as well. And 
one big part of that too, which is going to be a conversation farther down the road for um, us as a company is is getting into augmented reality and virtual reality and mixing that with robotics. I, I truly believe there is something huge going on that we all can't quite see the picture of yet and it's going to change our lives as we know it. We're going to probably have some sort of wearable where we can contact um, some side, sort of robotic um, piece of hardware and you can control it and do jobs for you and do certain tasks for you and you'll be able to tell it what to do and it's just going to become a normal thing. And my vision is in the construction industry. We have a lot of jobs that are just, um, they just don't need um, a lot of skill and they're not really difficult um, to where you could, you could create a robot that could do the task repeatedly over and over again. And if somebody, even somebody in an office could tap into that machine and make sure that it's it's doing the task and you can see it on your computer or whatever screen you have in real time and this is where the virtual and augmented reality comes in is maybe you can even put wearables on to where you can control them from even in your home or your office and we, we were a far ways away from that but it's just something that in my mind I think uh, we could go in that direction so that's a big part of what we're looking into at this company we're gonna be putting out tools that are gonna make the place more safer and more efficient for everybody for when we're out there doing the work but we're also gonna be looking towards the future where maybe we can come up with some products and services that are really gonna innovate the industry where it pulls people away and that's gonna be the big massive change from pain if you can offload these tasks to a machine that are painful tasks like maybe uh, hauling uh, debris, construction debris in and out of a house or out of a uh, building that could make a gigantic change for people it would eliminate so much pain and it would also give a lot of these people that uh, I know kids nowadays are are really into technology and they're picking jobs where you can work from home or an office and um, you can innovate um, right from home in a stationary position and it might also be really nice to train some of these people to control robots or machines to do some of these tasks out in the industry that aren't really um, super skilled tasks because coming from the construction industry myself I know that there's a, there's a lot of variables. It's not as easy as just cut and dry. Like you can just write code and and make make everything just just happen. So so it's gonna be a long journey. We're all gonna have to see where this goes, and hopefully, uh, infernal tool technologies can uh, be at the forefront of it all, and we can change the world together. So uh, if you guys could share this video and like it and follow me. And give me feedback. Comment below. Tell me about stuff that you might want to see me do in the future. Um, stuff I can change. Or give me some ideas on stuff you want to talk about. That'd be great because I just want to keep this dialogue going. And there's lots to talk about. The, the world is ever-changing. So like I said, comment below. Let me know what industry you're in and what are some of the changes you'd like to see. If you're in the construction industry like me, that'd be great to hear some feedback from you on what you think about the future. And um, I look forward to talking more with you guys and having a dialogue. Have a nice night. Thanks.